What is up, YouTube? Welcome back to the MMA Matrix. In today's video, we're going to be breaking down. Everyone knows next Saturday is Sergey Popovich and Curtis Razor Blades. Ooh. We're going to be breaking down this fight, giving our thoughts, and we want you guys to comment down below where your guys' thoughts are. But let's let's hop straight into it. Let's what do you guys right think? What do you guys think? I think it's not getting as much credit. It's like it needs to be more hyped up because this is some of the two biggest, baddest heavyweights in the division right now. No one's everyone's kind of overlooking this fight or yeah, underlooking yeah, I, think, I mean, they have a combined of 26 finishes. Yeah. 26 a lot finishes. of finishes. Both these guys yeah. have knockout power. Both these guys have insane wrestling. They're probably the scary. They're probably John and Jones' hardest threat right now. Yeah, yeah, I would agree with that. These two guys that. are the most dangerous style for John Jones right now. Not saying they beat him. I don't think they beat him. But. So we have num number three Sergey versus number four Curtis. So this wow. is a big. This is yeah. a this is super. A big, they're big the fight. top guys. They're they're the, they're top, the top guys. guys. I think this is a big fight when it comes to uh, title contention. Yeah. I think whoever wins this is probably obvious yeah. next. For sure. Let's break down uh, Sergey. What do you think he does good? Like what's what is what I mean, makes his, Sergey? His, I mean his hands. Yeah, bro. really, he really he's is fast. power. He's just fast, power and he's but he's fast. fast. His hands are very fast for combinations. Yeah. It's like sloppy too, though. He has like mm. real sloppy combinations or real really sloppy. Accurate. Like, but it's just the speed and the power. The like, the power it doesn't just, like yeah. his speed and his power for a dude that size. Mm -hmm. We're talking six six three, and six, he's three. super wide. Let's talk about his takedown defense because he's he's really gonna need this in this yeah. fight. Oh, oh yeah. yeah, he's really. Gonna and need I don't it. think he's never been tested by a real wrestler. He's never no. been tested by a real wrestler, but Curtis Blades, he's gonna test him. He's gonna we know really for sure. Test he's that, gonna man. test him. So will Sergey be able to? Neutralize the the takedowns. He mm. could possibly do what Derek Lewis did to Curtis Blades. Time it because that time power it. just he could time it too. But it's, since he's so fast, I think and he's also going to be expecting Curtis to take yeah. him down. He's going to yeah. be he's and that's be. a that's a disadvantage for the wrestler. Like okay, this ah. guy's going to shoot. I already know this guy's going to shoot. So <laughs> let me try to time some. Yeah, he, that Sergey has the 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 power to do that. Yeah, especially him. He's very capable. He's going to be expecting that and his how quick he is. Yeah, it's going to be hard for Curtis. So. How many times will Curtis even shoot? Yeah, How fast will he shoot? So let's talk about what 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 do you think is good about Curtis Blade? What does he do good? What does he do? He can do everything good. Man. Everything. <laughs> Ever, I think there's still some people sleeping on his hands, but this guy will go. He'll go stand and bang mm -hmm. with just about anyone, oh, bro. Sure. Unless yeah, you're yeah. a Francis Ngannou or you know Derek Luce, you know he caught him. He caught him. Got him. Um, but unless you're like that type of power, I mean Sergey's that type of power, but like. Yeah. No one's really beating Curtis, really. People yeah. sleep on that. So? Yeah. People sleep on that. No one beats Curtis except for Francis and then Derek caught him. But yeah, Derek he beats him. A, he, he dominates about everybody else he fights. So, yeah, it's important to know his, his grappling, his takedowns. Yeah, bro. That's going to be a huge factor in his fight. Yeah. I think that might be the X factor. This That's going to be telling. How different the wrestling is going to be, right? And yeah. we, we've seen Alistair Overeem in the past. It was a couple years ago. But he just dominated and out wrestled Sergey a couple years ago. But what do you, again? What do you think Curtis has the capability to do? Like, yeah, the site here says he, that Sergey has a sixty six percent takedown yeah. defense, but you can't really rely on that too much yeah. because his opponents they were not really they've all been like striking. They've all been they all just yeah. wanted to stand and bang stand with and bang them. A bunch of meatheads. Yeah, they, exactly, and, and they didn't even test his wrestling. They're not. They just stand and bang. Just stand and bang. They want to stand and bang with this guy after he's what he's been doing. And also, it also says that his takedown average is zero. So he's he not. Doesn't, he's not comfortable. In he's not area. gonna be. I know. Right, everyone just you know they assume Russian, Russian wrestling. He's wrestling. <laughs> he's bad at the wrestling. Curtis is the wrestling guy here, but yeah, by a long right. shot. I think since Curtis knows that, he's either gonna use that to his advantage. Or maybe he's like, you know, I know I could destroy this guy on the ground. Let me just yeah. stand and bang with him. Right. Blades, it says his takedown average per 15 minutes is 6.05. Per 15 minutes. Bro, he had... And he's see, also... I wonder if he would even go that fast against this kind this Nah, guy, I don't bro. think so. Because I think he knows the yeah, powers. Yeah. And he could get caught. So he's going to get smart, bro. He's got to have some kind of a fucking game plan. Yeah. Oh, A really sure. good he one. He can't just good. go in there and yeah. shoot from four feet away, <laughs> five feet away, and then just... Like, <laughs> It's dangerous. It's very dangerous to shoot on a so, big boy like that. I'm glad you said game plan because I think yeah. both of these guys is gonna it's gonna come down to game plan. Cause mm. Sergey too, bro, he needs a game plan for sure. Yeah. He can't just stand there and assume that this guy's gonna stand and bang with him. Yeah. He has to have a plan to what do I do if he just shoots yeah. takedowns the whole time. I man. think it's fair to say that both of these guys need a plan A, plan B, plan oh, C for, sure. plan for each other, man. For like sure. they they do. They for but sure. 
When it comes to plant, like we said, multiple plans and adapting, I think Blades has the edge because yeah. he has oh, more yeah, weapons. Bro. So much more weapons. Weapons since, and the experience. Since Sergey only has his power, his striking, if that gets neutralized, what does he have left? Ooh. What does Sergey have left? If, exactly, nothing. But on Blades, on the other hand, if something gets neutralized, he has something else to fall yeah, back he on. Yeah, he has a lot to fall on, bro. He has a lot to fall on. Man, That's why we're all saying this, right? Like, Sergey's just been fucking wrestling. And, like, I know. Yeah, he's, just, he's, he's, just, he's in a pool and Gandu and Gandu. Gandu. Dude, imagine if Sergey submits <laughs> Blades. He's, hey. he's, out, he's, out, he's out wrestling wrestlers in the gym right now. He's freaking... I mean, the only way Sergey can submit Blades is if he fucking stuns him and knocks him down. Start, yeah. Submission. Just charges like, right to him. But he's not gonna... He's not uh, gonna do that. So, uh, <laughs> so, quick question. Does this go all... Was it three rounds or five rounds? Five. It's the main event. I think it's five rounds. There's, There's it no go? way it goes five rounds. I don't think it goes There's five no, rounds. I don't think it goes five rounds. There's no There's way it goes. It goes. Yeah, Someone's getting go. finished. Someone's getting finished. Someone's getting finished. I think like third, fourth round. Third, late rounds? Finished. Yeah. I'd say probably... I'd say second. Second? Oh. I'd say second. second round or third round for sure. Second round or third round. All right. So I'm glad we're talking about this. So let's go. Let's get into our predictions. Let's get into it, everyone. <laughs> predictions. Right. Who's going first? Predictions. I'll go, I'll go ahead and say uh, I think it's going to be a very hard fight. Um, Sergey is gonna have some success in the beginning of the fight, but once Curtis gets it going, he's he's uh, tuned in. I'd say Curtis Blades, round two or round three submission. And I know that's kind of risky to say because I don't think Curtis has any submission wins, but I just think that the wrestling and the grappling is so different. It's mm. such so it's they're not even in the same planet or galaxy. Yeah, I think he's gonna use that to his advantage and catch him off guard, and catch Sergey in a. Whatever submission. I'm going to go with Curtis, too. I got Curtis winning in round two. I think Sergey's going to be rushing the first round, mm. trying to knock out Curtis Blades. And so. Curtis Blades is going to be defensive, really yeah. defensive. I think he might tire, tire out Sergey. Then second I round comes. I feel like Curtis is going to drop Sergey, either TKO him or submit him. Man, I'm, I'm honestly, I'm on the fence. I'm well, on the fence on this one <laughs> because I want diversity. I want our diver diverse picks. I don't want to. Yeah, okay, all the been, same fucking guy. Right, we always keep going for the <laughs> we, same. The same guy. Because so. we're smart, man. We're smart. Yeah. We know who's gonna win. You know. <laughs> but um, that being said, I mean Sergey's no slouch, man. He's definitely he hits like a truck, bro. Sergey has a very good chance of winning. Oh, very yeah. good very chance. Good chance. Very good. But Curtis Blades, man, he's more oh, well rounded. Cool. He's more well-rounded when it comes to like a complete fighter. Sergey doesn't have that much tools. <laughs> I'm gonna go Sergey. I'm Sergey. gonna go Sergey. Thir third round. Third Knockout. Round. TK TKO. TKO. Third round. TKO. Wow. He's probably he's gonna eventually break Curtis and Curtis. The power is gonna yeah. be too much. I don't think. I don't think he's gonna completely neutralize Blaze's takedowns. So he's but gonna get taken down. He's gonna get taken down. But for sure. you, you for see sure. him. You see him surviving, getting back up. I see him surviving. Um, I'm throwing my shot out there. I'm not like fully confident in that, yeah. but I'm gonna I'm gonna throw my shot out there. <laughs> Just shooting in the dark. Shooting yeah. in the it's dark. It's one of those fights. It's, it's one, one of those, those fights, fights for can, sure. It can go either way. We all think this is gonna be a finish, though. We're all saying finish. it's gonna be a finish. There's, it's not going. Yeah. It's not going. The real question is, what do you guys think? Do you got Sergey Popovich? or Curtis Razor Blades in this fight. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did, make sure you hit the subscribe button, hit a like button, comment down below what your predictions are. But that's our time here at the MMA Tricks. Me, Danny, Mark, signing off. Until next time, boys. We'll take see y'all. Y'all be cool.